Hello, this is Mr. Wright, and um, I just want to do a quick uh, screencast to um, show you how the rocket math um, suggests that you uh, study your multiplication facts. Um, so here I have uh, multiplication set C, and um, the outside problems that are going around the edge, those are the practice problems, and on the inside is the one-minute timing that we'll do in class. Um, so the way that they suggest you practice is to start here in the corner. We have um, uh, 2 times 4. And so the student would have this, this sheet, and um, they would say out loud the problem and the answer. And then they would move on to the next one. Um, and you need to make sure that the student doesn't pause or sit there and figure it out. They need to say it um, pretty quickly um, in order for them... Uh, to go to go on, so they would start in the corner here, and they would say uh, two times four is eight, four times two is eight, two times five is ten, five times two is ten, three times one is three, two times three is six, one times two is two, one times five is five, two times two is four, one times three is three, one times seven is seven. 3 times 2 is 6. And he would continue uh, on around the outside perimeter of the sheet. Um, however, if they come to a problem that they miss, um, the procedure would be to ha stop them, have them say the problem with the answer three times, and then go backwards three and have them start again. So something like this. Uh, 3 times 2 is 6. 5 times 2 is 7 which of course is wrong. So you would correct the student, 5 times 2 is 10. And then they would say it back to you three times. 5 times 2 is 10, 5 times 2 is 10, 5 times 2 is 10. Then you, they would count backwards three. 1, 2, 3, and they would resume from there. 1 times 3 is 3, 1 times 7 is 7, 3 times 2 is 6, 5 times 2 is 10, 1 times 2 is 2, 4 times 2 is 8. Um, and so they suggest you doing that um, for no more than five minutes in an evening or in a setting. Um, and uh, it is kind of important to say the problem and the answer because um, that's what connects the two in their minds so that whenever they see it, they can instantly write down the answer. If the student uh, hesitates too long or has to stop and figure out the problem, um, then they would go through the same procedures if they had missed it. So they would repeat it three times, go backwards three, and resume going on around. Um, so if they were to successfully get around the outside edge in that manner, um, then that would be a, a pretty successful um, uh, practicing of that set. Typically, the new problems of the set are always located the first couple ones on the uh, practice section. So here on set C, the new ones are 2 times 4 and 4 times 2, which is the same problem, uh, 2 times 5 and 5 times 2. Uh, all the other ones then they've had in previous sets, and they, and they build like that um, each time. Um, I hope you found this helpful, and... Uh, uh, if you have any questions, feel free uh, to email me.